So a typical day in undergrad would maybe be a couple classes in the morning and a lab in the afternoon and then maybe like a fun event or a club meeting in the evenings and then a little bit of studying throughout that. But a typical day as a first year student, we are here most days eight to five and it's a mix of lecture and hands-on, but it's really fun and they do a good job of balancing it out for us. But then because you are here, normally the evenings is like hand skill practice or studying. The hardest part about the transition probably would just be because in undergrad you're, you're used to taking exams and studying. That part's not so much as hard, but I think the hand skills part, that's new for everyone for the most part. And so when you're, you know, you study and you take a test, you kind of know what to expect for a grade. But then with hand skills, sometimes it's not the grade you want. And so it's just learning to see it as more of a progress instead of perfection on the first try. Because it is hard and there, there's always a challenge with that, but it's fun too to like learn and see the growth as you look back. I think something that I wish someone would have told me before I started dental school was just how hard it is to not compare yourself. Because I think when you think about starting school, you'll, you think that, oh, we're all gonna be on the same level because we're a first year. But everyone comes in with a different skill set and a different background in dentistry and so I think it's just learning that it's okay to maybe not be as good as someone else at something or that we pick up at different rates and just like being okay with that at the end of four years you're going to be a dentist and it's going to work out. So I'm from Barberville, Kentucky. Um, which is in southeastern Kentucky, and I went to the Cumberlands, which is in southeastern Kentucky. And so moving to Lexington has been really fun because it's, it's newer and it's um, just very different from where I'm from, so there's always something to do and there's new food to try. Um, but it's also nice because I am from a smaller place, and so you can drive 15 minutes and be like in more of a country setting, which is more homey. So I like the balance, and it's fun. And our class does a good job, I think, of like trying new things and like having get-togethers and stuff. So a smaller class size is nice because, one, it is what I'm used to, but, but I think also we get to know each other really well, which is very comforting. When you move here, you may not know anyone, so it's nice to know each other very well. And then our professors get to know us too early on, I think. Um, and it's nice when people know your name and like, you just, it just feels more like you can ask questions and be more comfortable in the setting. I think something I've been very impressed with is just they do a really good job of like slowly warming us up to things. Like it's not like we started dental school and we had 10 exams in a week and like a practical at the end of the month. Like they really warmed us up. And I think when you come in, I didn't have much dental experience before. And so coming in that helped me kind of have that transition because not only are you transitioning from undergrad to dental school, but you're also in a new place and you're meeting new people. And I lived on campus, and so I didn't ever really think about having like rent and utilities. And so it's just like a lot of new stuff on top of that. And I think they did a really good job of like welcoming us and walking us through those first couple months um, to where now it's like we're much more comfortable. We kind of know what to expect most days sometimes. Mm -hmm. So. Mm -hmm. So we started. I think we had small week the week before everyone else started and so it was nice to kind of just like already be used to it. Sometimes people can get overwhelmed by like how hard or how long the school seems but I think it, at the end of the day it's really fun. I really enjoy it and so I just want people to know that like it is hard but like it's worth doing because it is hard and it's going to be like to be able to be a dentist later on like that's going to be really rewarding.